what's up today we are back another video and video and video and <laughs> Y'all know how to dance it up. But guys, we're gonna be making a Starbucks tumbler cup, glitter tumbler cup. So I'm gonna show you guys how I do that. So yeah, y'all been asking me to do a video on how I make my Starbucks cups. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna show you the process and all of that. So let's get into it. I'm gonna put a picture up here of the cup that I'm going to be making. It's a um, pink drink inspired cup. That's what I know it from, Pink Drink Inspired Cup from Starbucks. So it's going to have strawberry decals in the inside, um, glitter, pink glitter, and hier pink hierographic glitter, and clear hierographic glitter. I'm going to show you guys all the materials that I'm going to be using in this video before I get started. So, I'm going to use my ring light, y'all, because my lighting is horrible. Y'all know, my lighting be horrible over here. So, guys, the cup that we're going to be making. Y'all saw the cup that we're going to be making. So, these are materials that I'm going to be using. So, the first things that I'm going to be using is from my Cricut machine. It's my Cricut weeder. The Cricut weeder. So, yeah, the Cricut reader got UV resin. UV resin. This is color pour UV resin. I got this from Michael's. No, I got this from jo Joanna's. Joanna's Craft Store. I got some hierographic glitter. This one came from, this is my from Christmas gift. It's my Christmas gift hierographic glitter. And then I got the pink iridescent glitter. Pink iridescent hierographic glitter. I don't know if you guys see that. Can you see that? We yeah, got that. Um, got this, and then I got two colors of paints because I'm gonna be mixing the color to make the white coloring, like the pink, creamy color. So you yeah, see these paints? I got these from um, Target. Got these from Target. As you guys can see, I'm gonna go back through everything because y'all can see better when I zoom in. So that's how that looks. This is the glitter that I'm using. It's the UV resin. Okay. And these are the decals that I'm going to be using. The strawberry decals. I'm just going to put a little bit in my hand. The strawberry decals we're going to be using are these. Have those in the thing. I'll show you guys in a better view once I get done. So I'm going to be using this type of tool right here for my um holding my cups my tumbler and i'm going to be using 24 ounce this is 24 ounce yeah 24 ounce tumbler cup hold on okay, I'm back. so um the 24 ounce starbucks cup i'm going to be using is this cup um it's some more stuff that we added i already cut out my um stuff that i needed for my cricket this is her name that and that I'm gonna show you guys that stuff. This is the the um UV lamp that I'm using. I got this from Amazon. I got this cord from um, this one from Amazon. I don't know what brand it is because I threw the box away. I had it for a while. So yeah, and I'm going to be using um this drill bit. It's the Hypro Touch Torch drill bit. And yeah, so this is the um. This is not the drill bit I'm going to be using. The drill bit is actually this one. It's actually a little bit bigger than this one. I forgot what size this is. It's the biggest drill bit. But this is the drill bit I'm going to be using to make the hole in the cup. Here's my scrapers. I'm going to be also using to make sure everything is laid on there right and correctly. So let's clean everything up. 
and let's get to work guys let's get to work oh my god i'm so excited so we're gonna go ahead and get everything started i'm not gonna do a time lapse or anything unless it's gonna be using in fast motion or whatever so i'm gonna have this over here i'm gonna unscrew the lid and all that put that over here we're not gonna be using this no time soon so i'm gonna place our cup on here just like that and move that over there i should move it up here it's still in view's perspective or whatever so next we're gonna get our stuff we're gonna weed this so we're gonna go ahead and weed all this stuff out this this um vinyl came from my craft store a craft store that's in my town it's called my craft closet so yeah this is how that that's her name and then this is going to be the starbucks logo that i'm going to be covering it up with But y'all like, girl, you need so fast. No, girl, I'm just uh, going through the motion, as you say. I can fix the face in a minute. She fixed the smell. There we go. And then I take this off the eyes. There we go. So that's how the Starbucks logo looks. As y'all can see, this is how the Starbucks logo looks. It's very cute. I mean, this is just a regular circle. So I'm gonna cut the weeding because I can use the rest, like the extra of this and something else. I always save my scraps. Like I have a whole bag full of scraps that I save. There's nothing I need to weed up this for. It's just a circle. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and put everything on transferred onto this cup right here. Make sure everything's in view for you guys to see. You guys see everything? Okay. So this is how the cup is. Make sure it's straight. This is why I got this. Cause this is very, very sturdy for when I want to place vinyl on there. I don't have to set it up and it won't be crooked. So that's a good asset to get add on for me my business basically so right now i'm just going to add the regular circle on here to cover that up so i'm using this to um using a, getting a blank circle basically to cover up the um other starbucks logo that's on here so basically this is just going to cover up the other starbucks logo that's on here I can get my um get the air bubbles out. See, there's air bubbles in there. A lot of air bubbles. I can pop that with my um weeding tool, but that covers up the other Starbucks logo. And the circle the size of the circle logo that I use is a 2.5. I did a 2.5 circle logo, but circle for the logo. So yeah, and then we're just gonna, uh-oh. We're gonna get this one in perspective onto here. Go ahead and peel that off. I peel off backwards because I can see and put more pressure on it when I'm bleeding it. If you guys can see. This is how that looks 
and I just place it on here like that just like that and it's straight and it doesn't look crooked or nothing look at that pretty how does that look guys you guys see it that's so cute now we're gonna turn it to the back and we're gonna add her name I'm really glad I got this because adding names on here used to be so tricky. I need to get another piece of transfer tape. But it used to be so tricky because I used to put the names on there. Cricket, guys. I mean, Cricket, Cricket. I'm actually upset when I have to stop and do it over and over and over again. Like, it was very crazy. But um, I'm glad I got this to work with now. So it won't be too hard. Can you guys see that? I usually add my transfer tape back onto the sheets that they came off of so I can reuse them. So I may reuse them again. Just removing her name, basically. And then you put the name on there like this. Make sure it's straight. There it is. Yeah, that's so pretty. Look at it. <gasps> Look, I almost missed it up, girl. I just almost tore it. Look at that. So that's her name, and that's the front. So that's done, we're gonna place that to the side. We're gonna get this cranked up. All cranked up. Now we're gonna work on the glitter. So the glitter part is gonna be a little fun. So let me straighten y'all up. Guys, yeah, so this is the cup. I'm gonna go ahead and get this off of it. So guys, I'm just gonna up now because when I used the drill, they came out pretty easy. Thanks. Power Adams must be your worst nightmare. Lose a lot of merchandise? No. I didn't lose anything. Just lucky, I guess. That's this. So we're gonna plug our drill up guys and get all this together. So hold on. Okay guys, so I'm back. So I got the drill all set up. I got the drill bit in there. I'm gonna look at the guy, look guys and see what drill bit I'm finna use. The drill bit I'm using is a, um, it's a 5.6, 5, 5, 5 and 16, I think. That's what I'm looking at. I don't know if I'm using tools, language, or whatever, right? But that's the measurement of that strip bit. I'm taking this strip bit off. I'm just unscrew it. And put the new drip bit in. So, guys, the drip bit's on. It's going to be a little loud, so hold on.
So I'm just trying to make the hole bigger now by pushing to the sides. Push it on the sides of the um, where the hole is. Turn my slicing and going a little bit bigger. That's there. Now we're done with the drill. Nothing else needs to be done with the drill. So I just hit it on the side, make sure none of the little pieces are in the inside. So I'm gonna get my strawberry decals and slide them in there. I usually use my Cricut tool to slide the tools on there and slide the little pieces inside. I might have to use my, um, do you see the slices are here, the strawberry slices? I just put a whole bunch of them on the top. Mm. So I just put a bunch of them on the top and I sit down in this part. I just slide them in there. So I'm going to go ahead and time lapse this forward. So I get two cups, the same size of it, and put them on each side of it, and put my lamp on top, just like so. But we're about to go ahead and do this. So we're going to add the UV resin on this side. Just gonna add enough in there to fill the top like that. And we're gonna put it over. Hold on, guys. I'm just gonna add more water into this to make the mixture a little more fine. Well, it's slow, I say. I'm trying to give y'all a better angle. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so I'm gonna close this up because I'm done with this. I kind of like how it's settling in this one. Can y'all see it? It's pretty, um, cool, the air distance and stuff like that. I like to fill most of it up with my, um, designs. For the glitter and the um, 3D cows because it feels more and it goes in through more. So, here it is. I'm going to mix it up a little bit. And I'm going to add um, my color mixtures in here. 
so the paint I was telling you guys about the light pink paint I just added depth of the dark one just gonna I could do it like this I'm gonna go ahead and open it all the way That's one depth. And then I add two other light pink ones. To the light pink one. Then I'm going to shake it up, let it form its color. There's the color, guys. Look at that. Look at that creamy pink color. Look at that creamy pink color, guys. Like it's so pretty. So, we're going to add it in the cup. And I like to put the mixture in there and shake it up a little bit. So the mixture can get all the way through. I like to shake it up a little bit. Make sure the liquid gets to the bottom. So it's a little fast right now. I'm gonna add a little bit more glue to my mixture and stir it. There we go. There's this. So I'm going to finish adding it to the top. And then I like to tilt it to this side to get all the liquid in there. There we go. So let's get a pepper to clean this off and add some alcohol in there to make sure that it does it. to kill the bubbles or whatever and I'm cleaning the top off from the glitter and all so right now I'm going to UV resin it so what I do with my UV resin I just pour it on there I usually put tape on there but I just want to pour it on there today wait I gotta open it sorry I'm going to show you guys the finishing results of all of it. i got to plug my lamp up first. Outlet is for my lamp. Where were my thing is for my lamp because I can't find it. But um guys, I'm gonna give me a second. Let me try to find my lamp thing.
I'm gonna put it on 90 minutes, 90 seconds, I'm sorry. Make sure it's under the lamp. Like so. Y'all can see that it's under the lamp. The UV lamp and it's curing. Yep, it's curing fast, guys. And it's curing right here also. Y'all yeah, really like this cup. I made these also. This one and this one. This one was a mess up, but it's still cute. But yeah. Once the cup is done, I will show you guys how it looks. I don't have the other piece to it because she has the top and all that. She dropped her cup and it messed up or whatever so i had to redo i was doing it redoing it she has it you get every time you get it like a glitter club or something like that you get 30 day warranty you get a 30 day warranty on it because just because something happens like the curing can mess up and it can be messed up or whatever the curing it can leak <coughs> anything like that so i give them 30 days of warranty on it and they can re get it redone or whatever so yeah Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe on this video. Y'all is almost done. It's so... Oh, it's hot. It's so pretty, though. Like, I can't wait to shake it and see how it blows. But I have to let it completely, completely get done. Oh, it's going to mess up. But, y'all, I hope y'all enjoyed this video of me making this cup. It was kind of hectic or whatever. But I love making glitter clips. I love making pretty Starbucks glitter clips. I love it, but um, that's because it's bumped my loop. I mean, I feel like I'm weak. I mean, like some days. Um, my face is slowly breaking out or whatever. But um, yeah. Um, if y'all want me to see me make other things and stuff like that, let me know. Let me know because I will make them for you guys. I'll make some keychains on here, like the keychains, like this video. This video, these keychains are here. Made it was a big order. Keychains and cups. Show you guys. These are the keychains. Those are very cute. I thought that I love the colors of those. That's my favorite order from 2021. My favorite order with the cups. Also the matching cups. I actually recently just did those for a Christmas order. Like that's my favorite. Like I have a lot of orders that I like, but like that was my favorite because I like the colors. Like the colors like that. I like bright colors. But um yeah so that was pretty fun um it's a lot of stuff that i gotta talk to you guys about because your girl's been in my a yeah. business been good i must say business has been good you can be slow at times but yeah so the cup is done i'm gonna show you guys the cup so the cup is done so let's see if everything is good on my end Wipe everything off. Yeah, look at it. Oh my god. Make sure there's no leaks. Yeah, look. It is so freaking pretty, y'all. Look. Can y'all see it? Like, y'all, this is so cute. Oh my God. This is better than the first one I made, y'all. This is so cute. And I hope she likes it. There's some stuff that sticks up there like that. But other than that, oh my God. I actually like this one. Cause it feels all the way around. So I know what I did differently. Like, yeah. No leakage or nothing like that. So I'm hitting it. Make sure there's no leakage or anything. Holding my hand out like this. This is how I make sure there's no leakage. I still don't think on my hand is leakage. Just trying to make sure there's nothing. So right now for the cleaning process, I just clean my cup. So, what, how I clean my cup, y'all, this is so cute. Like, it looks, it's so pretty. 
Oh, this is so freaking cute. Like, it's so pretty. Like, I wish I could show. I'm gonna show you guys. I'm gonna show you guys. But this is so cute. So this was the first, was my first, this is this is a cute book. Like I love Starbucks. Like this is this is cute. So um, let me see. If y'all want to see me make other things, let me know. If y'all have a whole bunch of stuff in here, I'm planning on making me a new cup, a lemon cup, a lemon style cup. If y'all want to see that video, I'll be making that. I like lemons, so I was gonna do a lemon style cup. But this is cute. And you have to shake it like this to get it to slow rise. Oh my god, it's so cute! It's so cute, y'all. But, um, yeah, this I have to do the cleaning process now. So, the cleaning process, I usually get this in my sanitizer. Hold on, cleaning process, I usually, um, just do the basics wipe it down with the wipes and stuff like that. Make sure it's clean and sanitized disinfected and stuff like that so so So, yeah. Yeah, this is so cute. This is so cute. I make sure I clean all the cups out that I make. Because, like, COVID is still around. Like the bottom needs to be just like this, guys. Like it needs to be back like the bottom of the cup. Back like the bottom of the cup. Like smooth. Not lumpy dumpy smooth. So I recommend this UV resin. I have bought some other one. So the one from Amazon I really like is $9.99. But I really like that one for a crick and get it. But it's more expensive than that one. So yeah, this one is a must. Like this is so cute. I'm gonna show y'all the video of it. So guys, I forgot to close the video out for making that cup. I'm editing it now and I forgot to remember, I just realized I forgot to close that. So make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Turn your post notifications on y'all. I'm just not getting off work. But make sure y'all do that. And smash that subscribe button. Smash that like button. And join the game because you know it's lit over here. We're doing back to back bangers. We got better content coming out. Better videos, better everything. So if y'all ready for that, just stay tuned. Subscribe, like comment we're gonna um for some odd reason our comments are off so i don't know why i'm keep saying comment for some odd reason our comments are off but we're gonna turn our comments we're gonna get our comments back on for you guys but if y'all guys have any content y'all want to watch y'all want me to post make sure you guys go and just go to my instagram my business instagram or either my personal instagram the personal instagram is gonna be right here the business instagram is gonna be right here they're both gonna be right here so make sure you guys go and um, follow me on those. DM me for any content. I'm going to be posting a lot of content uh, questions on my business and my personal page. So make sure you guys stay tuned and look at those. If you guys want shout outs and stuff like that, I'm going to be doing shout outs on videos and stuff like that. So if you guys want shout outs, 
Make sure you guys follow, do all of that. Follow my so, follow my social medias so you guys can stay tuned and up to date. So we're gonna also work on new content for TikTok and all of that. So yeah, make sure you guys do that. See you guys in the next video. Hey.